Can I please have a chocolate pistachio and a banana cream? There's nothing plain or old-fashioned about them anymore. Donuts have been elevated from the mundane to sublime. Cream cheese, peanut butter frosting, peanuts, bacon, um, banana chips, and a homemade marshmallow. You've heard of boulangerie? Well, this is a donuttery, and sweet tooths have been making pilgrimages to the glory hole in Parkdale. It's perfect. I've never had a donut like this in my entire life. At three to four fifty a ring, artisanal donuts don't come cheap. Once you've done uh, about a thousand, you <laughs> you kind of instinctively know when to flip them. Ashley Jacot de Bueno used to work at Scaramouche and Buca, and there's no cutting corners on the four-hour process. Her fluffy concoctions are made with yeast, and everything is done by hand. We use Twitter um, every day to, to try and update people of how many flavors we have left. The earliest record of what we know today as the donut dates back to 1808, and it was actually the Dutch who introduced them to North America. Back then, they called them Ole Cake. Literal translation? oil cake. Paulette's original donuts and chicken in Leslieville serves up a denser version, but they're just as decadent. This is our donut robot. We couldn't live without it. The cake batter gets plopped into the fryer by machine and are done in exactly 140 seconds. And this, it flips, fries on the other side, and then just comes right at the end, a perfectly golden, delicious donut. If you like sugar, Paulette's aren't just iced, they're fully dipped in all natural ingredients. So you get that amazing like ripeness from the wild blueberry and then the tartness and tang from the, the balsamic on top. So it's a little bit more grown up. If you need proof that the donut has risen to fine dining status, look no further than Pangea. Their warm citrus trios are made to order and have been the best selling dessert on the menu for two years and counting. The combination of the citrus sugar and the ricotta and the marsala wine actually reminds me of a panettone. Donuts so done up, it. an affordable indulgence. Don't even ask what the calorie count is. If you're going to have a donut, mm. indulge, enjoy it, and go work out afterwards. Mm -hmm. So just to give you an idea, bacon, homemade marshmallow, lemon meringue, mm. the one you're having is mojito. Mojito. Those are grown up, are they not? Mm-hmm. Salted pretzel. Yeah. Dark chocolate, all homemade. Uh, Leslie, you can have <laughs> one after the show because I wouldn't want it to mess up your suit. Oh. I have this terrible. But what deal. about me? Yeah, Am exactly. I like top <laughs> liver over I'm here? I'm done. Oh, I'm impressed. Well, you're you don't helping really yourself. Normally eat sweets. You're not a dessert person. That's my weakness. No, 